trout fishing on rivers can be really, really challenging. Not only is the, the water moving and you've got all this line management, but you've got different currents and the fish could be another side of a slow current or a fast current. And you have to do a lot of different things when you're casting. It's not just a case of just casting out straight as you do on still waters, but there could be different currents. So I'm going to give you a little training tip here. It's um, aerial mend. Um, just imagine you're fishing across a river and you're faced with some fast water closer to you and then some slower water where the fish are feeding. Now, the problem is if you cast directly across, what will happen is where that fast water will grab your line and drag your fly out of the way. You might get sort of two or three seconds where the fly is sat fishing properly and then suddenly it's ripped out of the way of the fish. So here we were gonna do. What we wanna do, we wanna put some slack line in where the fast water is. So the way to do this is, first of all, get out on the grass. In front of me, I've got a bag. Now that represents the fast flowing water. So I want to put a mend exactly where that bag is. So what we do is, first of all, we're gonna cast straight. Now you're gonna deliver the fly out there, but then where the bag is, you're gonna maneuver the rod tip around the bag. Now when you're doing this, don't put any power into it whatsoever, otherwise it affects where the fly goes. So simple and easy, what we do, point and then maneuver around the bag. And what you'll see then is you've thrown an upstream loop directly where that fast flow is. Now the reason I've got a bag there is this. Sometimes when you're faced on the river, the flow might be closer to you. So you can step closer to the bag and then get the mend really late in the cast. Then sometimes that flow is further away from you. So you can step away from the bag and then put the mend a little bit closer to the fly. That way, when you can change the mend, whether closer to you or later in the cast, you can actually dictate exactly where. So when you're faced with the water, there's a fast flow here or a fast flow there or a fast flow there. You can put the mend exactly where you are. Otherwise, if you don't have the bag there, you'll just put the mend anywhere you want and you won't be able to dictate exactly where that upstream loop is. So remember, put the bag there, point the rod beyond the bag and then move it around the bag. Simple and easy.